Should you fast or not fast as a woman? Is it dangerous or is it good for you? Well, it really depends on where you are at in your menstrual cycle. Timing really matters. Now, your cycle has two major phases. The follicular phase, and that starts on day one of your period and ends at ovulation. And then you have the luteal phase, which is after ovulation until your next bleed. Now, in the follicular phase, estrogen gradually rises and estrogen is like your metabolic superpower. It makes you more insulin sensitive, gives you more stable energy, sharper thinking and a better stress tolerance. This is a phase where fasting actually really works with your biology. It's really good. Fasting here can improve blood sugar control and also help reduce inflammation. It's a really good tool. And inside my fertility circle, when you join, you'll hear me saying exactly what I'm about to tell you. This is not about starving or punishing your body. It's about aligning with your hormones. And this is why after ovulation, when progesterone takes over and progesterone increases your metabolic rate, your calorie needs, your appetite, and makes your body more insulin resistant on purpose, so it can prioritize building a lining for potential pregnancy, this is the time where we do not fast. Because when you try to fast aggressively in the luteal phase, your body interprets that as a stressor. Now cortisol rises, progesterone then drops, and blood sugar becomes really unstable. Your cravings get worse, your mood is shittier, and your period can even arrive early. So the truth is here, fast in your follicular phase when your body is naturally primed for it. And really please stop forcing fasting in your luteal phase, especially the week before your period. This is when your body needs nourishment, not restriction. Your hormones aren't trying to sabotage you, they're trying to guide you. And when you understand them, your metabolism and fertility stop feeling like a battle and can start feeling like teamwork.